Hi, my name is John and in this video I will show you how to edit this template. This is the 01 WooCommerce tabs for the categories. Okay, you can see that these tabs have uh, the categories and this is the, the products in this category. And for this, you can go to the Bricks editor and WooCommerce tabs. You can change this. Okay, this is very, very easy. Click on the class and change the styles. Um, this is the heading. Remember, if you change this heading, uh, all headings of this set of WooCommerce will change, okay? Because have the same uh, class. Uh, this is the product tab. You can um, edit. Um, and this is very important that in tab menu, you can click. And if you see this template in mobile version, you can see that the um, this tab menu you can scroll okay you can scroll but if you don't like this um, you can delete this class okay delete this class tab scroll mobile delete this class and delete this fill gradient mobile okay save and if you reload okay then now don't scroll uh, for this case, I I set this this class uh, tab menu. Remember tab menu, and this is the the class. You can change the styles, the product tab menu. You can change this is the category. Okay, click on the class and change the styles. Category name, this is the divider. You can change the color of this divider, okay? This case, uh, this case is red. Mm, you can change the background. This is the background for this uh, gray color underline. And this is the active. If you need to change the, the color for the hover, you can change this 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 value okay this is the color for the hover uh, underline okay this is the, the divider click on the class and change this line this color of the CSS mm, this is the content uh, very easy and this is the pro grid you can change the number of columns uh, click on the class okay click product grid click on the class content and you can change this this value, okay, for uh, three. Um, for example, three. Um, reload. Okay, three columns. You can change this for five. Okay, this is the very very easy, and you can change the number of columns uh, in different breakpoints. Okay, in this case two, three. You can change the the, the the columns of the grid now you can go to the product card okay this is the product card and you can see that this is a query loop and uh, query and you can change the number of the products okay you can set uh, five six seven eight uh, the number of product that you need in the top okay uh, for this example okay uh, save uh, reload remember the four columns uh, and i can change this for a and reload and now you can see that uh, load eight uh, products okay in this case four is four um, remember that if you change the style of the product card okay this product card and the blog and the image content heading all elements with the same class okay all um, templates with this same product card will change okay if you change this card all elements um, for example the um, archive template the um, single product recommendation template and uh, the rather products and the um, uh, slider carousel uh, okay, all ele all elements with 
this product card will change, okay? And this is the way to edit this template. I hope you, you like this, this template. I see you in the next video.